Who's fucking hyped? We got a lot to do. And I'm trying not to make it take so long, you feel me? So let's just jump right in. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. What's good? <laughs> yeah, the puppers, I'm sure you'll see them. So, hello, hello. Do you see the new emote, by the way, Tiffs? Is it available? It should be. Let me see. Yes, it is there. No, not that one. It is officially live. <laughs> what a clown. I did it, everybody. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it is, but am I the only one that thinks these just hit different? The minis? There's just something magical about them. It's got to be like the ratio, the candy ratio. They're so good, man. All right, let's dive right in. Cheek scam tips. Boom, boom, boom. Always, always, always wash your hands in the kitchen, everybody. For a good 30 seconds. Super important. Am I eating? I was eating some M&M's. Are you eating cheeks? I am not eating cheeks, you bozo. But like I said, those M&M's, man, how can you not munch on those? You know? They are just so freaking good. Do they make minis of other kinds? Probably not, right? Probably not. No. There we go. Perfect. They do, they just, they taste different. I, I really think it's the ratio in them. I really, really do. Cause I got like more candy since there's not as much chocolate, you know? All right, so the very first thing that we're gonna do everybody is we gotta work on our dessert today. So let's get this water boiling. So pretzel bark, very, very simple. You're actually gonna be blown away with how simple it is. You can do it with white chocolate. You can do it with dark chocolate. You can do it with any chocolate. Yes, Tiffs. You know what I used to do with those? I would literally just eat the whole cylinder in one go. And you would you would get so much flavor. You missed the stream, you bozo. You're just in time. All right. You haven't missed a damn thing. But yeah, when you eat the whole cylinder, it is so good. But then you know, like after that, it all goes downhill because well, that's all she wrote, right? That's all she wrote. So here, who here loves enchiladas, by the way? Anybody? Who is excited to see some enchilada cooking? Let's go. I don't think I've had one. What do you mean? You've never had an enchilada? You're kidding me. There's no way that's true. 
No way. Well, I can tell you right now, if I if I were close to you, I would make the recipe a little bit different because this one is going to be spicy. So, and I know for a fact, if I think it's spicy, then you're going to think it's nuclear. <laughs> what the hell is this new emote? That's Manzy Mouse, my guy. Duh. <laughs> Come on now. I laugh like Mickey Mouse. Alright, first step to make pretzel M&M bark. All you do is get some parchment paper and you want to line the pretzels on the bottom just like I'm doing right here. <laughs> Mandy Cinematic Universe, true. But yeah, every time I laugh now, you guys have an emote to mock me. How neat is that? That's pretty neat, right? <laughs> I think it's hilarious, too. I spent a good solid hour working on it. <laughs> oh, Lord. Also, we have two new channel points, everybody. We have a classic one. And then we have one that Zoomers might not know. But I think it's funny because it feels Boomer Man. Alright, pretzel tags. Gotta make sure the pretzels aren't poisoned. <laughs> do it! Post it in the Discord. Obviously, I couldn't do that as an emote because of copyright stuff, but I would I would love to see that Dude Disney is like that one company you do not want to mess with man. They will get you Yes, sir -ree. Alright, that looks good. I like the way that looks. Alright. So we've got our... As you can see, it is quite hot in there. we got some boiling water. Now we're going to start melting our chocolate. And yes, it takes a ridiculous amount of chocolate for this. So yes, this is how much you need. This is... um. About a pound and a quarter of chocolate. I know, right? That's actually a fact, though. So let's go ahead and get all of our chocolate in there. Actually, something smells like it's burning. How is that even possible? What's burning? Hey, if I burned on the whole kitchen, that would be content, right, everybody? That would be pretty good content. You know, focus is off. That's not focus, my guy. That's just the camera. It, there's uh, a bunch of smoke, so it's making it hard to see. It's the lighting. It's a bad camera. But yeah, it's because of the smoke. Can't you see it all, bro? Look at that. Now let's turn it down a little bit. But man, I cannot wait to make enchiladas. I love them. Tips, 
I'll even wa- how does it sound? Even while making this, I will tell you how to make it not spicy, okay? Even though mine is going to be spicy because I think you would absolutely love enchiladas and I don't know how you've never had them. That is a crime and a half. Ed, you need to get this woman some uh, some enchiladas, my guy. That is crazy. Not like the, the Taco Bell ones, either. Don't worry, I'm not disrespecting our Overlord's Taco Bell, but they don't have enchiladas. That thing, though, that you did have that one time, I forget what it's called, the Enchirito or whatever, is basically an enchilada. He would never. What do you mean he would never? I guess I better uh, tell my buddy I'm live too, huh? Ligma, 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 just in time, bro. Thank you for that posture. Thank you, thank you. So, Ligma, we're working on our dessert right now. So, you can actually microwave all this chocolate. You just gotta do it very slowly because, um, chocolate burns pretty easily. So, I would recommend if you are ever microwaving chocolate bars to do it every 30 seconds mix. And then. After that, just keep going 30 seconds, repeat, 30 seconds, repeat until it's it's nice and moist. Yeah. We are making pretzel M&M bar caligma. You know, when I decided to make this too, I thought of you, Tifferonis. I was like, you know what? This is the dessert Tifferonis would adore. And now, after we make it... Oh, that's kind of loud, huh? Sheesh! Wipe it down. That was a loud one. There you go, I fixed it. Sorry about that. It got me too, don't worry. Not loud enough, true. But yeah, you don't need an oven to make this. You don't even need a stove to make it. You can literally just make this with a microwave. It's that easy. Ligma, look at our new emote, by the way. Manzy Mouse is live, bro. Tell me what you think. Your mom, good one. <laughs> what a bozo. What a bozo. All right. <laughs> yeah, we got the pog too. I did re take out one emote for now. It'll be back. To make room for the pog. Because, you know, you gotta have the pog. You gotta. Alright, who's drinking with me tonight? Anybody? Yeah, Cajun is gone for now. You knew right away. Who's having a drink with me tonight? Anybody? The chicken nugget emote will be back, bro. It'll be back. I promise. I did not get rid of it. I put it away momentarily. 
You're bozo. You're gonna die, clown! <laughs> Alright, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. If it weren't the Nuggets emote, which emote would be on the chopping block? Tell me that. Right now. Which one would it be? Alright, as you can see, by the way, take a look at this. Mama Ozob, hello. Look at that, everybody. It's looking uh, very nice. Exactly, it has to be it has to be the chicken nuggets one. I love that emote, Mama. Mama Bozo. Welcome in. You know what we're making? We are making today some Maybe you'll actually know you're a baker yourself. Maybe you'll have an idea. So we've we've got some pretzels lined on some parchment paper. We are. Oh, uh, you just spoiled it, Tiffs. You bozo. You bozo. Chocolate dinos. Yes, chocolate dinos. You got it. Okay, this is about there already. Okay, okay. Alright, let's switch it on over here. Here comes the good part. Get your pogs ready. We're making pog res here. Oh, I need to make a bozo one, actually. Get your poggies ready. The magic is happening, everyone. Sheesh! I'm gonna pre you. Sheesh! I'm gonna pre. I'm gonna pre. Oh fuck! I'm gonna pre. <laughs> Oh man, I'm gonna love this so much. Not enough. Bro, there's more chocolate. Picky Picky Ligma. <laughs> Bro, the fo- Do I need to literally screenshot it? The focus is totally how it's supposed to be. It's the lighting, bro. I'm telling you. We have lights all over here. You are killing me. Once it gets later in the stream, it'll look better. I promise you. I promise you. I should have done dark chocolate, huh? Like a, a sea salt one. I think that would have been probably even better. You guys all like dark chocolate? Who likes dark chocolate? Like a, a nice sea salt dark chocolate? Let's fucking go. You don't like dark chocolate, Tiffs? Oh my Lanta. What am I gonna do with you? You picky girl, you. Well, good thing I picked this then. We wanna be very delicate. Maybe they're just blurry because my camera sucks, bro. Okay, I'm gonna literally show you. Alright, guys. We gotta take a quick 30 second pause here. Because Ed is being a bozo and I wanna prove him wrong. I 
All right, here we go. Here we go. What a bozo, man. What a clown. Here, you ready? The spaghetti? What kind of spaghetti? Spaghetti. Here. You the bozo. No, I'm tired of your shit. I will not stand for this. My Italian just got perked. True, true. All right, here we go, here we go. By the way, has anybody here ever had California style Mexican food? Just curious. You can't keep getting <laughs> away with it. This one's really bad. Hold on, I can probably make that one look a little bit, a little bit better than that. Just a wee bit. It did not get super clean. I didn't do anything. <laughs> what are you, you, you accusing me of changing it before the picture, bro? I would never do such a thing. That doesn't sound like me at all. <laughs> I don't know what you guys are talking about. Okay, it was definitely at 40. Here, I'll even prove it. <laughs> See? <laughs> All right, Ed, are you ready to be amazed? See? See, I told you so. <laughs> See, duh, it was always like that, bro. All right, so we want to cover all the pretzel here. Just spread it out a little bit. That's what she said. <laughs> Dude, Eds, come on, bro. I took a minute out of my stream for you. And you're not even going to look... Come on. That's just downright disrespect, bro. <laughs> no, no, no. Back to the quality. All right, you guys want me to fuss up? Okay, I'll admit it. I changed the settings. Is that what you want to hear? Is that what you want to hear? Eds was right again. Is that what you want to hear? <laughs> Excuse me, Vespin. <laughs> you are such a bozo. <laughs> How about you come up here and say that to my face, Vespin? Get in here, you dude. Come on. Wouldn't be a Mansy cooking stream without my dog barking, right? All right. Who wants to see a pupper? Can we get some KC Blue emote spam, Marino, please? If I don't see any spam, you're not going to get the CM. You know the drill. All right, there we go. Here you go, stinker. Now Zeus has got to get one. Can we see some Zeus emotes, please? Uh, some Zeusies? Come on now. Loving on one dog when there's two is not fair to the other one. We all know it to be true. Look at him. All right, sit, 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 yum. All right, where were we? Yeah, 
Yeah, Zeus is about to take out the stream. Sorry, everyone. Stream over. What a bozo. Anyways, the question. Does anyone here know what a California-inspired Mexican dish is? Ligma, did I miss the speech? <laughs> Bro, I am... <laughs> I'm not going to do a, st a flippin' speech right now. That would be pretty pog, though, huh? Podium in the kitchen and everything. You're so funny, Ligma. Did you get the, uh, the Buena Beef yet, bro? All right, you know what? I think I needed a little more chocolate. That's okay though, that's okay. But yeah, a California inspired dish for Mexican food, everybody. It just means there's like french fries in the burrito and stuff like that. All right, the last step. Let's get some good old Amarinos in there. Let's go. Sheesh. <laughs> oh, Ligma. Oh, brother. Oh, brother. All right, ads, where's your reply, you bozo? You don't want to reply because I was right all along, right? I understand. I don't like being wrong either. Out. Get out. You're not going to be a trash monster tonight. Phone too far. I feel that. Hi, right, what do you think? More Eminem? How's the ratio looking, everybody? One for more Eminem, two for it's just right, and three for Bozo. I think it looks pretty good. How about now? Still a one? I think it looks pretty good. Look at that. That's a pretty good ratio, I'd say. What do you think, Tifferonis? I think it's good. I'm done with that. I implore you to reconsider. <laughs> All right, so we got to pop this in. Let it get cold. This is going to be ready by the time our enchiladas are done, so. Time to get started on the the real part of this stream. Not that this is gonna be, not gonna be bomb and not, that, not the star, but enchiladas just hit different. They really do. Leon! 
But yeah, who wants to have a drink with me? Anybody? I'm about to have something. Nothing beats the blast. Toke, tokes are acceptable as well. Alright, let me get something to drink. I'm gonna give this a go today. This is not my normal. As I uh, struggle off screen. Okay, we did it. We did it. Nobody needs to see me be a bozo. King Zack, I want to see that so bad. All right. Everybody, this is what I'm going to have today. We are going to have... Delicious. Woo! Let's go. The Spider-Man movie was great. Oh, I know somebody in here that really, really enjoyed that one. And I'm sure she's about to start typing about it right now. Haha, <laughs> there she is! Oh, you're sick? Oh no. Sorry, I'm looking for a bottle opener, everybody. Do I need to go ask the Papa Mans? Hey, give me one second, everyone. No, you don't need to come up here. It's just, I need a bottle opener. It's not a twist off. All right, I'll be right back. One second, everyone.
Alright, alright. I've gotten help, everybody. You, of course you have to pay for Photoshop. By the way, there's Papa Manzi, everyone. Better be getting the podium. You sound like a child. Yeah, imagine expecting everything to be free. Couldn't be King Zag. <laughs> I'm just teasing you. Oh, there it is. We found it. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Alrighty. Cheers, everybody. Mamos, my man. How are you, buddy? We're, we're pouring some wine right now, so if you'd like to have a drink with me, go for it. This is going to be so good, too. Cheers, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for watching. That's pretty good. So, since we are doing a California inspired enchilada, dude, Mamos, pour one with me then. Do it. You don't have to, but you should. You feel me? But yeah, since we're doing a California inspired enchilada, we will be putting potatoes in there. So we do need to wash the potato, peel the potato real quick. And if you've never had potatoes in Mexican food, you need to try it because it's actually ridiculously good. Highly, highly, highly recommend it. It's a whole big ass cuisine they have down there. everybody it's been a very long time what is that case of an investigation by any <laughs> dude I don't even blame you man his stream is kind of chaotic you feel me dude boss TV welcome back in bro it's been quite a bit God, it must have been almost two months ago bro I appreciate that so much welcome to the clown show brother Welcome in. So we are making chicken enchiladas and let me let me show you one more thing. What you mean chaotic? Bro. <laughs> you 
know exactly what I mean. Alright, let me show you what we've already done as well. Thank you for that follow, BRJ. I appreciate that. We have made ourselves a delicious bark. It's a pretzel M&M bark. Shame. <laughs> Shame. So this is getting nice Shame. and cold. This will be ready in about an hour. And then, yeah, we're working on our enchiladas right now. We just started the whole process. We're peeling our potatoes to put in there. What do I do if my potato starts growing things? <laughs> well, it depends how much things. Those things are actually extremely toxic. I don't know if anyone knows that, but when a potato starts sprouting, it's very toxic. So if it has like a bunch of it on there, and you know, you know, everyone always says you can just, you know, peel that right off. Well, it's still going to be a little toxic, but you know, who cares? Who gives? Seriously though, boss, thank you so much for that. It's nice to see you in here again. And I hope you guys uh, stick around and have a blast. You're not going to die from it. You're not going to die. I promise you. My brothers, I see in your <laughs> eyes the same fear that would take the heart of me. A day may come when the courage of men fails, when we forsake our friends and break all, all bonds right, of cheers. fellowship. Also, we are drinking. So, boss and, and crew, cheers, and brothers. If you would like to have us comes have a drink down. with us. But it is not this day. This day we fight. By all that you hold dear on this good earth, I bid you stand, men of the West. Biggest thing when you're cutting a potato, everybody, always make sure you're cutting it when it's flat. <laughs> Feel okay, man. Are you gonna have a drink, boss? Get out some alcohol, bro. You don't have to, but you should. You don't drink? Hey, I respect that. Honestly, the only time I usually drink is uh during this stream once a week, so. Yeah, we want these to be pretty thin sliced. This is kind of what I'm looking for, something like this, everybody. So we're going to do that a couple more times. Cheers to the most <laughs> bozo of them all. I don't drink, but I will took up for you, you bozo. What do you mean you don't drink? I've seen you drink, you bozo. Unbelievable. Who does this man think he is? Manzi hotboxing the podium. <laughs> I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, Ligma. If this... If these enchiladas turn out to be the bomb diggity... I will do a kitchen edition speech, okay? Just for you. You hear me? Just for you. But only if you're on your best behavior. Bozo, 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 <laughs> bozo, bozo. You're a bozo. Are you gonna behave this time, Ligma? <laughs> God, it's still kinda loud. Tiff, did you jump from that one too? The power of victory is too strong. It's just too strong. <laughs> Alright, one more. Again, make sure it's flat like that and then make it flat again hell yeah what you drinking mamos do I have to pull out a shot for the boy I got some uh 
some liquor I can pour. But only if other people are doing it with me. Fireball. Sheesh. Fireball. What a guy. I haven't had fireball in a long ass time. Who here likes fireball? Press 1 in the chat if you're a fireball enjoyer. The crack. Dude, the cracking hits, man. I tried so hard and got so far, but in the <laughs> end, it doesn't even matter. I had to fall to lose it all, but in the end, it doesn't even matter. I also saw, um, last night I was watching a streamer, guys. He did a vodka Capri Sun. Has anybody here done that before? A vodka Capri Sun. Only drink Malort come on Chi Town. Dude, Malort is so nasty. Alright, Cap is here. Cap, are you pouring with me, bro? I just said I would do a shot. Are you pouring? I'll only do that shot if you're pouring, bro. No porn. What you mean, boy? That's on my only friend. Guys, if you want to see my exclusive content, go on my only friends, okay? We don't advertise that here, except for just now. And I will never, ever, ever show you the goods right here. You hear me? It's got feet pics. It's got... Horn, uh... I don't even know what I'm saying at this point. I am the biggest bozo ever. It's got nice hand porn. You know, all the good. Manzy Mouse TV on OnlyFans, everybody. It's only $1 per month. <laughs> okay, Cap. Nobody needs to know that. That's I thought that was our secret. I hope you guys like Mandy Mouse, the new emote, though. I think it's so funny, man. And to think, Mama, Mama Ozab, one day was like, when you laugh, you sound like Mickey Mouse. And now we have a Mandy Mouse emote. It's just like that. It's that easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord oh no I think it's so funny cheers everybody bro you can't do a shot of high noon what is that bro you gotta have something. Cheers, everybody. Okay. So we're starting this. We're gonna get our potatoes cooking. So we're gonna put a little bit of vegetable oil. A little bit of vegetable oil in the there. The only beer that I'll drink is Michelob Ultra. Michelob Ultra's okay. Um, there's better ones. I gotta show you the light, bro. It's not even the best one. I can show you the world. That's a good idea, Mamos. I don't want to be responsible for puke o'clock, you hear me? Our potatoes are going in, everyone. Sheesh! The 
magic is starting now. Potato. Alright, Tiss. What is the most important thing when you're cooking? Every time you add a new ingredient, what do you do, girl? I know you know the answer to this. <laughs> That's for the smiley fries. Get out of here. Get out of here, you bozos. You didn't come here for school. Girl, I'm making you your favorite dessert, basically. And you're going to be over here like that? Ungrateful. I tell you, ungrateful. What a bozo. Dude, this camera's really bright, man. Holy moly. We're going to put a little onion powder in there. What's with the sass? <laughs> Can't a man be sassy every once in a while? Is that not allowed here? Okay, so we need to get some color on these. You pop quiz. True, I did pop quiz you. Okay, well the answer is, every time you add a new ingredient, you always have to add seasoning. You want layers of flavor. <laughs> Alright, Cap, relax. Relax. A little bit uh, too harsh on the language, bro. Good lord. This is a PG stream, excuse you. Don't mind me drinking here. <laughs> Not harsh enough. No, I'm over it. I'm over that one. So we're just gonna... We're gonna do an audible, everyone. Because this camera's too bright for my uh, face. So we're just gonna do that. How's that look? Now you guys can always see the sizzle. Alright, cheers. That's okay, Cap, look. Look, Cap. Look what I'm drinking. I know, I know. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, King Zach. When did I do that? I was talking about only fans, not only friends. <laughs> Busted me on the spot. Can you believe this guy? Can you believe this guy? <laughs> Alright, so we're going to get a sweet onion cut up here. We want to add that right to the potatoes. <laughs> oh, Lord. Busted, disgusted, never to be trusted. <laughs> True. Not wrong. I don't even blame you for that one. Thinking this is probably plenty. To be honest. So we're going to put that right in. <laughs> if you know, you know. Dude, that was hardly any onions, bro. Alright, let's get that going. Jack and Jill. Does anyone here like that movie? Jack and Jill. You guys are crazy. You're saying that's too much onions? You do realize a normal recipe... A normal recipe would probably use all of it plus this. You guys are crazy. The only reason why I didn't do that is because I, uh... 
I put onion powder in it. Okay, we need to put some garlic in here. Some garlic. I haven't even seen that one. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. That's what I'm saying, Ligma. I don't, how do you not like onions? Onions are so good. Okay, we need to really let this let, let this cook down because we want some color on these taters. Yeah, I've been to Maxwell's, of course. So what are y'all thinking here? We doing the one three one pound chicken or the one two five? Let's do this one. At this point, I just assume the majority of uh, gamers are picky. No offense to everyone here, but 80% of my viewers are picky, and it is what it is. Oh, this is smelling really fucking good, everybody. Sheesh! Look at that. All right, cheers. All right, so we're gonna cut up some chicken real quick. Got a new cutting board, a new knife. And we're gonna, on purpose, not trim the fat. Just for tifferonis. I'm just kidding. I'm just pulling your leg, Tiffs. Just pulling your leg. We're gonna trim it for you, girl. Honestly, though, this chicken that I buy is pretty good. I love Little Nicky. Such a good movie. Honestly, though, this chicken, usually I don't have to trim too much of it. It's usually pretty spot on. Okay. That one's good. And I can show you, like, it. There's hardly any fat on these bad boys, as you can see. All right, so we're going to, as always, we're going to want to make them more thin. So we're going to do the butterfly technique. Okay. Make it a nice, even cut. Make it cook faster. Make it smaller. It almost is going to look like a heart, everyone, just like that. That's butterflying. Okay. There is a little bit of fat right there. Let's get rid of that. <laughs> Those fingers calm down. <laughs> you just made me Mansy Mouse. Yeah, butter free, true, W free, rip and peps. All right, we don't want this to be too thick with two C's. 
It's an enchilada, not a freaking taco, you know. Not all about the meat in there. That's what Pikachu she said. Pikachu is just an electric rat. <laughs> um, where did I put that? We need to start getting the oil heated up in a pan for this chicken. We're going to actually do it in a separate pan, everybody. Oh, no. I can't get it open. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. We got it. We're good. We're good. Got to watch them chicken hands. So we're going to put a little veggie oil in the for the chicken. We're going to heat it up, move it around a little bit. I know you can't see it, but I'll show you right here. You know, just move it around. Make sure it covers everything. Um, the best oil to cook with depends. 1,145 true, but Raichu is a better Pikachu. Raichu is not a Rats better Smacken Pikachu. Told me to tell the you death to all but do. <laughs> bro, is he want to be in the Shadow Realm for all eternity, bro? Alright, so the best oil to cook with depends what you're cooking. Because they all have different smoke points. They have different flavors. For example, if you're doing like a... Personal, this is my opinion. If you're doing like... French fries, for instance. I would use peanut oil every day of the week. Peanut, penis oil, okay? It's the best oil for frying hands down. And it's not even a competition in my opinion. Like legit. Not even close. But if I were doing like a, uh, a nice wine sauce chicken on the, uh, the stove, I would do olive oil. Olive oil has got that very healthy flavor to it. It's got a good amount of fat. It's got a really good smoke point. It'll get your uh, chicken very nice and crispy. But of course, there's other great choices too. Um, avocado, avocado is good. Coconut's good. Ironically, vegetable oil is considered the uh, like the most unhealthy cooking oil of them all. But I almost always use it for for Asian-inspired dishes um, and Mexican as well. You could use olive oil for Mexican too, though. Was that a good enough answer for you? Red smacker. And canola oil is good too. But I don't really cook with canola oil. The reason why you usually use oil is uh, to avoid burning, of course. But another big reason is because of the, uh, the smoke points. And it adds flavor, it adds fat. You need, when you're cooking, you always need fat. Because it's not going to taste very good if you don't incorporate fat to the dish. It's just the way it is. It's kind of why people use butter, or why people use, you know, like, fat from a, when they cook a steak, or bacon grease. It's the same concept. It's adding fat to the dish. Because fat is flavor. Alright, let's get this chicken going here. And then, of course, since we just used chicken, we want to wash our hands. So, just for you, Tiffs, just for you, I'll give you another treat this evening. A nice cheeks cam.
cheeks for free too for free Yeah, double cheek cam. Cheeks, 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 <laughs> cheeks. Cheekception. Let's go. <laughs> All right. Cheeks. Some pepper, salt, more onion powder. Sorry, everybody. Onion powder is great. It brings out flavor. Some more garlic. And since it is a Mexican dish, we do want to give it a little bit. Hey rats, Macaro G here. I'm currently laying in a hospital bed because the Badoof God sent Pikachu after my <laughs> ass. So from now on, I am no longer a part of Badoof. Hate, I love the do. What do you mean? Wait, on <laughs> what is going on here? You guys like onion powder, but not actual onions? Hello, come on in. All right, so we're gonna add a little chili powder in here, everybody. Just a little bit. We're gonna add, where are you at? Where are you at? Paprika? Y'all are wild. And last but not least, if I can find it, We're going to add some delicious cumin. I mean cumin. PG, by the way. PG stream. Oh, that smells good. So the reason why I'm cooking this on the side is because I actually don't want the chicken fat with the potatoes. I want to keep those flavors separated. Okay, this is ready. Let's turn this down. Yeah, Lima, get at him. Get at him. All right, you want to see how this is looking, everybody? Check that out. Check that out. Sheesh. Let me get you a zoom in. Look at that. Delicious. Alright, this is the part you're not going to like, Tiffs. But it is what it is. Okay, we're putting green chilies in. It's going to be spicy now. We're making it spicy. Also, one in the chat if you want me to make cilantro lime rice. Or two if you want Spanish rice. Let me know what you guys think. Spanish All right, Spanish it is. I see a bozo in there, you bozo wet rats. <laughs> All right, let's get the Spanish. That sounded bad. Forget I said it like that, okay? More cheeks. Is 
If you guys don't have yourself a rice cooker, I cannot recommend it enough. Please get one if you got the funds for it. If you eat rice a lot, it is definitely worth your money. It makes it so simple. You can do box rices. You can do regular rice. All you got to do is put it in there and press a beeping on the on the monitor and bam you got yourself some rice it's that easy and honestly they're not even that expensive so it's definitely worth buying one <laughs> Zach <laughs> Tastes like soap? What tastes like soap? Cilantro? Yeah, some people genetically can't taste cilantro correctly. It doesn't actually taste like soap, but they don't have a gene that makes it not taste like that. It's actually quite interesting. So I'm very sorry to hear that, Tis, but you're not the only one. Like, I, I want to say like a good third of the population tastes soap when they eat it. It do it, Mamos. Trust me. Yeah, this is actually too big of a piece here. But yeah, it doesn't taste like soap, actually. That's just your jeans, unfortunately. Unlucky. Alright, so we are just using box Spanish rice today because we are trying to speed things up. It's the uh, good old brand. Everyone's seen it before. Still delicious. You need a drunk night. Well, you can get drunk right now, girl. I'll drink with ya. So we can do some drunken street fighters. How does that sound? I can kick your ass. But at least you'll be having fun, right? You bozo. Right, I'm gonna pour some more wine. I don't think she has anything to drink, unfortunately. Poor girl. Cheers! Are uh, you guys seeing this? Look at this color. Check this out. Sheesh! Let's go. Look at those spices. It smells so good, everybody. <laughs> Can you elaborate on that, Zach? What pentagon? Here we go. Sheesh! this again so yeah, when you're making Spanish rice everybody this will not make it spicy but you want to put in I would recommend this put in some green chilies green chilies are very mild tips I honestly think you could even handle it so they're very very mild You put that right in with the rice. Okay, okay. What do you want? What do you want? Green chilies are not spicy, girl. You poor thing. It actually makes me feel bad.
Turn the chicken down. It's about done. It's got lovely color, everybody. Look at that. Look at all that. All that seasoning. You can see it in the water there. It's going to be delicious. And then the last thing we're going to put in there is we're going to put in some canned tomatoes. Because every, every Spanish rice has always got tomatoes in it. Just a little bit. Actually, Mamos, before you found out about me, I did the I did the last dab a little bit ago. All right, so we're gonna mix the rice mix around with the uh, the green chilies and the tomatoes. Press one in the chat if you want me to put corn in the rice. Two for no corn and three for bozo. Okay, this is what we've got so far. Okay, now we need to put the water in there. A chef arm pose. You know, they always do this on the TV. Yeah, does anybody want corn in the rice? Anybody? My, <laughs> my dad's like, no, no corn. That's funny. <laughs> oh, Tiff said yes. Okay, anyone else? We got a no, we got a bozo, embracing, embracing his inner bozo, dude corn is bomb, okay this chicken's done, so we're just gonna let that rest for a little bit and then we're gonna put in with the taters, the potatoes, everything's gonna start going really fast here so get your notebooks everybody, <laughs> okay Zach wants corn, <laughs> I'm not going to tell him that. <laughs> he might come in here and be like, bruh. Bruh. Also, cheers, everybody. Big cheers. So we got two. We got two for t yes for corn and one for no. Anybody else? Get your votes in quick. Gonna put about a cup of water in there. All right, here we go. That's okay, Mamos. As long as you're having fun, bud, do what you want to do, bro. I will still be drinking. All right. Who's down for an all caps mother cook off? You guys think I would win? Who thinks I would win? One in the chat for W. Oh, got him, Ligma! What a bozo! What a bozo! Dude, that would be a fun stream, actually, Cap. For sure. Alright. Yeah, I can't beat the power of the grandmas. Their cooking is too strong, man. The grandma recipe always hits different. Always, always, always. Okay, chicken's going in. We don't want all the juice. There's a lot of flavor there. We're going to take some of it, but not all of it. Of course, you son of a bitch. Of course. 
All right, let me go get your pack. I'm gonna have to start bringing these down. All right, Zach, one through ten. One through ten. You pressed the wrong button. <laughs> well, it's too late now, you bozo. One through ten. Five. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Oh, good pick. An evolving sky pack. You sniped it, bro. That's the best pack you can pull. Now, let's see what's inside it, though. That's what she said. All right. Can we get some Pokeball Spamarinos, please? We need some good vibes. I'm not opening it until I see some vibes. All right, all right. Grass, digging glove, stormy mountain, shell gone, Dino. Teddy Ursa, Hitmonchan, Fletchling, Scraggy, Mareep, and what do we got here? Ah, oh, it's just a regular hollow Hydragon. Pretty cool, though. Pretty cool. Another one. You can't win them all. You can't win them all. At least we got a hollow. What'd you have, Mamos? What'd you eat? Popcorn chicken. God, I haven't had that in a fat minute. Let me tell you. Zach, aren't you the one that collects that shiny cardboard and you just called it stupid? I don't even know you anymore. Who are you? The popcorn chicken is bomb, though. All right, let's get a little bit of juice in there. Not the whole thing, though. We do want some of that good flavor. You hear me? Okay. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> yeah, you are. What's going on here? Also, if you didn't see in the Discord, everybody, I put a little vote in the general tab for the social tab. We will be starting the Zeldathon either Monday or Tuesday. And I would just like to know your feedback real quick on a couple of things. So if you haven't already, please check it out and get your vote in, okay? So we're going to put a little bit of enchilada sauce in here. Yeah, Zelda thong. True. A little bit of the enchilada sauce in there.
Oh, the smell is coming out, everybody. Oh, I'm smelling it now. Can you feel it, Mr. Krabs? Can you feel it, Mr. Krab? Mama Bozo, what's up? What's up? <laughs> That's what she said. Let me show you what we got, Mama Bozo. I already know you're going to like this one. It's actually done. Do you guys want to see me eat this right now? Yeah, you missed the speech. Look at that. Look at this pretzel M&M bark. It is all ready to eat. You guys want to see it? You want to see me eat it right now? One in the chat if you want to see me eat it. Two for no, three for bozo. Or do you want me to wait until after the enchiladas are done? Should that? <laughs> Poor <laughs> Ligma. Yo, cheers to that. Cheers to that. freeze it why would i freeze that shit what do you mean all right well it's obvious you guys obviously don't want to see me eat it right definitely didn't see any ones there all right all right i'm just pulling your leg God, Mama Bozo, what a bozo. What a <laughs> actually fell for it. Doesn't she know I'm a troll by now? <laughs> alright, alright, let's sit down real quick here. I'll take a quick breather. Put him in the shadow realm. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Wow, look how good that looks. Sheesh. It's so simple, too. Actually, I can probably just do this. Look at that. Can even, like, smack someone with it, you know? Just boom! It's still a little, a little warm. The chocolate's melting on my hand. I thought I was a mouse, not a bridge troll. True. Dude, if I drop it, that would be such a good highlight. One in the chat if I should drop it. But of course, make it look accidental. It's not ready, but we're going to eat it anyways, okay? Look, it's pretty damn close. Look at that. Can we get some pogs? Let's go. I don't even care that it's not ready. I'm going in. Mm, mm, mm. You know, you know the happy dance? My little happy dance. That's what I'm doing right now. Jeez. Woo. Wow, that's good. It's so easy, too. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Wow. And you saw how easy it was. You saw it. Let me um tell you guys a little secret, okay? If you give me a tasty dessert. You're like 90% to a ring, you hear me? That's the secret to my my love.
Wow. Tips, you need to make that. You need to make that. And you know the way. You know the way. Alright. Now where were we? We're gonna cut a couple jalapenos. Look away tips. Act like these aren't being cut right now. You hear me? Just act like these aren't here. Girl, if you thought that was spicy, girl, I, I, I am so sorry. I am so sorry, but this is going in there. We haven't even gotten to the spice yet. Jalapenos ain't anything. You, you would literally die from this. Make it green. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. Who's having fun? Cheers. But don't worry. I'm not putting a lot of this in, okay? Not a lot. Make it green. But yeah, who's having fun? If you tell me you're not having fun right now, oh boy, oh boy. You don't want to see what I would do. I do need to mix up the music though. I've been using the same music for uh, every every cooking stream. Unless you guys are really digging the music, it is a vibe, but... <laughs> Mama Ozob, I'm not having fun. Hell yeah, Mamos. You know what? Just because you said that, we're doing a shot. Who wants to do a shot with me? You don't always get to do a shot with Manzarino, but just because Mamos is such a peach... We're gonna do one. He is such a peach. We're gonna do my favorite. God, I hate this shit. We're gonna do some Jameson. You hear that? You hear that cork? Oh, sheesh. All right, who's pouring? Who's pouring? You only get so many opportunities here. And then I'll tell you all my uh, my Jameson story, why I hate this shit so much. It's actually quite the story. All right, I'll give everybody one more minute. Yeah, get high. You don't have to drink. As long as you're doing your thing, you're smoking, you're token, you know, doing anything that's, you know, floats your boat. I am cool. My brothers, I see in your <laughs> eyes the same fear that would take the heart of me. A day may come when the courage of men fails, when we forsake our friends and break all bonds of fellowship, but it is not <laughs> this day. An hour of bodies I just and shattered fields when the age of men comes crashing You heard down. it. But it is not this day. This day we fight. By all that you hold dear on this good earth, I Badoof, stand, men of the world. Oh, the Badoof! Yes, true. True. <laughs> all hail Badoof. All hail Badoof. Mandy the father figure, true. That's me. Can you imagine if I ever have any kids and they look back and they see this? They see me doing random speeches behind a very real podium. They see me opening cards. 
They see me screaming at the monitor. They see me trolling everybody. What do you think they would think? <laughs> Thanks, Mama Ozob. Thank you. <laughs> Why you gotta bring the assassins cream in, bro? Go make some babies. <laughs> Yes, it's the best podium out there. The best in the Midwest, you hear me? The best in the Midwest. <laughs> you know, Ligma, I have a little secret to share with you. Now, I don't know how many people know this or remember this, but I did say... The enchiladas turn out dope. I would do a kitchen exclusive speech. But Ligma, what if I had it all along? What if this podium has been by my side this whole time? How would that make you feel? Alright, shot time. Cheers, everybody. You had your chance. Cheers. Ding. Ugh. Never gets good. Never, ever, ever. Father figure, by the way. Mm. Where's Jack? So, I'm going to go ahead and leak this. Bottles of Jack, one of my... My homie, she's wonderful. She's been very busy, though, unfortunately, lately. Um, but I'm going to let you all in on a little secret, okay? That's a Naperville podium. Bro! <laughs> <laughs> What's Naperville? I've never heard of it. Putting me on blast like that. Anyways. When she tells me, gives me the go-ahead... And says that she will be watching a cooking stream. We are going to be making some chocolate martinis, everybody. Chocolate martinis. And I will show you just how to do it, okay? But like I said, she's been busy, so I'm waiting for her to have some time. That girl is getting married. She's been going through all that financial crap. Alright, we're going to put these jalapenos in. Jalapognos. Let's mix that around. Now let's get these uh, the super spices in. Look away if you don't like spice. Just imagine this isn't happening. Because I won't lie to you. This stuff is pretty spicy. Dude, like you can see the color. Just looking at the color you're like. You just know. There are some uh, really day, good long, flavors. Long, long time ago. <laughs> there was this mouse. He wasn't just any mouse. He was a special mouse. One that lived at a circus. His favorite thing to do was watch the clowns. The mouse thought to himself, <laughs> I want to be a clown to Dr. That's a good one. Can we get that on the Discord, the please? Mouse trained for years go to be you, the best Ed. Clown go you. Ever was. He put on a show in front of everyone. They all <laughs> laughed at the mouse. But why? He was yeah, just a bozo mouse. <laughs> Who knows, but the legend of Manzi Mouse will continue. Seriously, that's a copy pasta and a half. Can we get that saved forever? I better see that again. 
Put that in the Discord, the copy pastorino. Alright, in goes the spicy. The color red. Yeah, that was ducking great indeed. Alright, let's put one more in. I repeat, look away, Tiffs. Look away, it's not happening. Nothing's happening over here. You know it's spicy because I don't even want to touch it. Weird ads. That was awesome. Thank you, bro. All right, we are good with the the chipotles. Let's mix it around a little bit. Let me uh, switch you over. Okay. Are you hungry, puppy? You ready for dinner? Does anyone here have an animal that eats on their own time? Like if you give them a set dinner schedule, they won't eat it. But then randomly throughout the day, they're, they'll be like, bitch, it's time to eat. Casey! Or is that just my dog? Go on, buddy. And of course, since I have Zeus who does have a schedule... Every time I feed Casey, it always starts drama. Because Zeus just stares at the food. Because he's like, bitch, where's my food? <laughs> you want goldfish? <gasps> hey, no puppy battle. No puppy battle. You want a little snack? Okay, I'll give you a little snack, Zeus. Don't tell, don't tell the parents, okay? This is our little secret. Don't tell them. Okay, so it's not... <laughs> So it's not just my animal. Noted. That's good to know, actually. Oh, man. Now I can smell the spice. Woo! Here it is. I'll get you guys a nice close-up in a second here. Oh, yeah. There it is. Oh, you live in Canada, Mamos? Sheesh! Daddy, yes! <laughs> I know that, that was Cap, wasn't it? Was that Cap? It sure was. Let's fucking go! True, Mama Ozob, true. So I saw you said, is it Verde? No, it's not Verde enchiladas. I know, I know. Be angry at me. Oh, no, 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 no. Casey finished eating and Zeus was like... Started gobbling up his food as fast as possible. I could hear him eating it. I do like the Verde, but my fam, my fam likes it like this more. All right, we're going to put some black beans in here. One in the chat if you're a black bean fan. Two if you're a pinto bean fan. And three if you're a bozo fan. All right, cheers, everybody. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Both dad. Daddy, yes. Oh, yeah. All right, we need a little more enchilada sauce. Cheers, everybody. All those flavors need to cook together. Sweet, sweet harmony. Sheesh! Sheesh! All right, you want a close up? There you go. I know everyone's like, can you show us it better? Look at that. Yes, you can see the spice, but man, does tell me that doesn't look good. Tell me right now. <laughs> Cap. Tell me that right now that that doesn't look good. Gordon would be proud. True. Tips, I can make not spicy enchiladas, by the way. So if I were around you, I would definitely make it so you could enjoy it. I'm not just teasing you here, you hear me? Same with Mama Ozop. If I were around you, I would make a, a wonderful verde enchilada. I know you would like them, both of y'all. Well, it's not that hot. I didn't even put all the jalapeno in. Or the chipotle, I mean, to be honest. It's not even all in there. Come visit and make us. Oh, oh my God, Tips! I totally misread that. Oh no, the last word I misread that. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna put a little cheese in the mix, just a tad. This is a nice Mexican blend, so it's Monterey Jack, Cheddar Jack, you know, all the good stuff. Who doesn't like some cheese? Mix it around. <laughs> Tips. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. You dirty, dirty, dirty dog, you. If I'm not sweat, oh, you'll be sweating. Trust me. You will be sweating. All right. So this is actually done. We're going to bring this into a bowl. It needs to cool down a little bit because when we're filling the enchilados, the enchiladas, we don't want to sear ourselves, you hear me? Because that would be very painful. So, Mamos, if I were ever in Canada, now that I know you're from there, and I wanted poutine, what would you recommend? What is the best poutine? The manchiladis nuts. <laughs> Mama Bozo, there, you missed an opportunity. There's a D's nuts channel point redemption. You need to redeem that right now before the joke is over. I did that just recently because you were like, can we have a D's nuts? And I delivered. You think it's too late? What a bozo. Missing out on the on the joke. What a bozo. Smokes poutinery? So what exactly is that? Is that a restaurant? Also, is the what is that donut place in Canada called? It's I forget what the name of it is. Can you remind me? 
It's like the Dunkin' of Canada, the Dunkin' Donuts. Is that place really worth all the hype? No, you don't get any more. Just because you bark at me doesn't mean you get snackies. Yeah, Tim Hortons. Tim Hortons. That's the one. I boomered it. <laughs> Rookie mistake. Who are you? It's like I don't even know you anymore, Mama Ozob. The real Mama Ozob I know is her. Would have landed that joke. Casey, I swear to God, cut it out. You've been spoiled tonight. It is. It is worth the hype. What is the best thing at Tim Hortons? These nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Got me. Good one. Got me. Good one. Woo. <laughs> no, I'm kicking you out. Come on. Come on. You're getting the boot. You're getting the boot. No, no, no. Both of you are getting the boot. It's funny, they work as a team. Casey starts barking, and then Zeus is like, oh, oh, he's gonna get his way. So he comes charging in. He's like, oh, oh, oh. Goofballs. He literally sprints into the kitchen when he hears barking. Little does he know, though, I just rejected it. Denied. Alright, so this needs to cool everybody. You want to see this real quick? They're coffee and donuts. They use really good beans and make somewhat fluffy donuts. Sheesh. Dude, I'm a really big fan for a cake donut. Like a blueberry cake donut. I'm not the craziest about the, uh, like the cream filled ones and jam ones. But I really, really like Long John's too. Look at that. Look at that. There's the filling, everybody. Can we get some pogs? Can we get some pogarinos? No, stop it. You're ruining their immersion, Casey. <laughs> That's what she said. The Mickey Mouse. You made me Mickey Mouse. Pog. There's a Pog emote, Mama Ozob. I added it too with the uh, with the Mickey Mouse, the Manzy Mouse. You're better off using that, you bozo. <laughs> All right. All right. So now it's time to actually make the enchiladas. Okay, fine. You win. You win. Come on. He thinks I'm talking to him. <laughs> guide game? No, not guide gamer. I know you're trolling me, but... This one, you bozo. Thank you, Mamos. Thank you. Get out of here. One in the chat if I should spoil my dog again. I've already gave him the T word 30 minutes ago. But what do you think? Should I give him another one just because he's such a cutie batootie? I mean, look at look at him. Of course he's playing me, but look at him. Look at that adorable little guy. How can I say no to that? Oh, you're still hungry? Oh, I see. He wants more dinner. We have to put his food away because Zeus will eat all of it. 
Yeah, he knew you were judging him. <laughs> alright, alright. Let's get to the bottom of this. We got some enchiladas to make. Press 1 in the chat if you're having fun, by the way. 2 for Bozo. 3, three is not an option. You're not allowed to say you're not having fun. You hear me? That's an illegal take. Almost worth a punishment of death. <laughs> Two, four, five. What a troll. <laughs> ligma, 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 ligma. Bro, you lost your sub. Any gifters in the chat? Does anyone want to give Ligma a nice sub -aroni? Poor guy. He doesn't have the emotes anymore. At least he has the podium, right? <laughs> Mama Bozo! Wow! Wow! It, Ligma! Thank you so much! Wow, that's amazing. Let's go. Can we get some hearts for Mama Bozo? It's that easy. That's so sweet. Now you can Manzy Mouse. Yeah, let's see some hearts, please. I'm not seeing enough hearts for Mama Bozo. There we go. Hell yeah, everybody. <laughs> what is FNF? What is NF and FNF? I really do appreciate you though, Ligma. You're always here. You're always got good vibes. I just want you to know that I appreciate the fuck out of you. You're always creating fun in the in the stream, making people laugh. That sub couldn't go to a better a better viewer, my guy. All right, here we go. For real though, Mama Ozob coming in clutch. I know I thanked you, Mama Ozob, but thank you again. Big heart. And also, of course, cheers to that gifted sub, everybody. Cheers. Get lit. Light up. Drink up. I agree, Tiffs. I agree with that. I agree. Okay, so we're going to start making these.
Make sure you got your whole station ready before you start. Organization is very important. We got our cheese ready. We got our sauce ready. We got our pan ready. We're good to go. And you'll see the process. It's very simple. It is very simple. Let me see if I can get a better look for y'all. We really do have the best community. You guys are all so amazing. Mamos, Mamos is new, but he's a goat too. He's only been around for about a week, man, but he's a homie. Straight up. Glad you decided to stop by, Mamos, and that you're still sticking with us. I know you stream too. If you guys haven't followed Mamos, please one do it. He us. does stream, so show him some one love. I have been one meaning to check us. you out, but I've just been so busy one lately, of man. Us. One of us. One of us. All right, so we want to put a little us. bit of sauce in this pan. Not a whole lot, just enough to cover it. Can we get a shout out for Mamos, please, mods? I can't really do it right now. Thank you. Thank you, Tiffs. Phasmophobia. Do you like it? What'd you think of Phasmophobia? Oh, we had a double whammy. Hell yeah, dude. I've heard good things about it. Thank you, Ligma. Thank you for showing some love. Appreciate that. All right. This is what I'm looking for. Just a light layer of the sauce. Is that blood? It's enchilada sauce, Lazy Gage. Dude, how is it? How is it? Are you still slapping in Sekiro? You still kicking ass and making names? We're making chicken enchiladas. And let me also show you, Lazy Gage. Let me show you. I know you're going to like this one. Let me show you what else we have. Look at that. We got some nice pretzel M&M bark, Lazy Gage. I know you want to eat that shit. If nobody, if like, if you tell me you don't want to eat that, you are out of your mind, completely out of your mind. We have Pinterest mom dessert. <laughs> oh, the Mandy Mouse, you got me, you got me, you got me. Some blood chilada sauce. True, true. You're not wrong. It'll it'll look dope though. Just wait. Where do you live again? You live in California, right? Is that correct? The Mexican food there is out of this world, man. Out of this world. Okay. So filling first. It's actually, let's get a little bowl so I don't have to reach into this every time. I want cheese. Sorry about the loud noise there. I know, man. I know it, Lazy. I know it. 
Even the shitty one is top tier. The, uh, the, God, what do they call it there, Lazy? When you're drunk and you go get a burrito? There's a term in California. It's like, um, the regret burrito. That's it. The regret burrito. Because you know you're going to have the shits the next day, but you do it anyways because it tastes so good. Give me, give you some cheese. All right, some little enchilada sauce. All right, open wide, open wide, King Zack. Open wide. Ah. Uh... <laughs> All right. And then you're just gonna roll this. Just like this, everybody. Take notes. And it will probably spill out a little bit. That's totally normal. You just want to make it so it doesn't spill out. And you'll pop that right in. Okay? And we'll do it again. We'll run it back. So it goes filling, enchilada, and then cheese. True. Never regret any burrito. True. You could honestly even do it like this. This is more the more standard. You just got to make sure you tuck the food in like that. And then you got a nice enchilada look. See? Nice enchilada. The one that I did first was more like a burrito here let me show you see that's how you roll a burrito what I just did this is how you do an enchilada I did that first one for you guys because I know believe it or not a lot of people do not know how to roll a burrito and it's actually criminal So I thought I would show you guys how to do it real quick. I'm actually going to re-roll that one. Also, can I get a quick vote, everybody? Do you guys think I should change the music up next time? Because I've been using the same soundtrack for... Um, God, what, it's been like, uh, what, six or seven streams? Should we mix it up next time? Thoughts? Let me know. You're not going to hurt my feelings. It's pretty dope, but is it time for change? Do we need another chef one? <laughs> Zach. I right, noted, noted, noted. cheese what is your guys favorite cheese mine is Havarti Apple smoked Gouda. You don't like cheese? How many different cheeses have you tried? I mean, I'm Italian, so yes, I'm I'm almost offended, Mamos. Yo, take back take back that shout out. Remove it, remove it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, bro. Pepper Jack, that's a good one. I really like um, pepper jack. I agree with that. I like the creamy white cheeses the most. So like provolone, Havarti, you know, that kind of stuff. That's my my spiel. 
Wait, so... Damn, not liking cheese. That's got to create some problems, huh? Oh, you're lactose intolerant. Wait, so you like cheese? Do you actually like it, but it kills you so you don't like it? Or do you really not like it at all? Gouda is Gouda. True, true. Yeah, that sucks, dude. If I was allergic to dairy, man, I don't know what I would do. They do have lactose intolerant pizzas, too, but they're just not the same. I've tried them. They just aren't the same. They don't hit the same. They really don't. Oh, this is going to be a thick boy with two C's. Can we get some thicks in the chat? This is Mother Bertha. Just make sure when you're doing a thick one, you make sure you uh, tuck it in. That's what she said. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. All right, there's half. Let me wash real quick. We got to do another pan. I miss Tifa too, bro. Did you see the announcement, Zach? Early 2024. Final Fantasy VII Part Two, dude. I preed. I could not be more excited for that game. I will be literally pulling all-nighters until that game is done when it comes out, bro. Alright. So we'll touch this up a little bit later. I'm not done with that, but I want to get the other enchiladas done. So we want to layer this again. Just like we did before. You're, oh, you're, oh shit, it's happening to you? Old age is getting to you? Dude, that's a fear of mine. When I get older, like, am I going to be able to handle cheese? I don't know what I would do, bro. How are you coping? You just eating it anyway still? You're just like, fuck it? Cheese is too good? Yes, Zach. I will literally be playing that shit. 12 hour streams all day. Until completion. You know it. I'll be streaming Final Fantasy 16 in a couple weeks. I know you wanted to see that as well. That game's going to be so dope. So we're going to... By the way, we are heating it up to 400. These are going to take about 15 to 20 minutes. And then once they're done with the 20 minutes, we're going to put it on broil for about three or four minutes, okay? Because we want to get the, the cheese on top of the enchiladas nice and crispy. Very important. It's going to add texture. It's going to add flavor. It's going to take it to another level. You know, we're all about elevating that flavor here. You know it. Zeus probably saw someone walking, if you guys can hear him. Guy can be a bully sometimes.
just curious though, if you guys could have me stream any game, what would it be? What is everybody's favorite game in the chat? I want to hear it. What is everybody's favorite game? Favorite game of all time. <laughs> Favorite game is your mom. Hey, did, if anyone wants to know how old I am, I do have a chat command by the by the way for that. It's explanation point age. If you were ever wondering. A Minecraft stream. Oh, I don't know. Type one in the chat if you want to see Minecraft. I was playing your favorite game. Oh, t Twilight, huh? Boom! Got him! Lazy fell for the oldest trick in the book. What a bozo. What a bozo. Dude, Twilight's a good one. That's a good pick. I respect that. It's not my favorite Zelda, though. My favorite Zelda is most definitely Window Waker. Manzi's like 13 or some shit. What do you mean? Yeah, bozo. Also, cheers. Cheers to Lazy Geese falling for the oldest joke in the book. Pretty sure a 13 year old couldn't cook like this, Lazy. That would be crazy. Minus one. You mean D minus you meant to say lazy? Is that what you meant to say? D minus. <laughs> okay, okay. Alright, we got six, two more, two more enchiladas. We're almost there, everybody. Vesp, that's Vespin's thumb, everybody. Can we get some Pog? We got a thumb of Vespin, the viewer. Yes, the viewer, not the brother, the viewer. It is. I asked the chat. I said one for cilantro, two for Spanish. They said two. They said two. Vespin doesn't like uh, Spanish rice. You guys betrayed him. I want to see you stream Scary Maze Game. What is a Scary Maze Game? Give me an example. If you'd stop by bro nice to have you bro hearts to you you want to see what we've got so far rich we're making chicken enchiladas and we already got our dessert done you want to see the dessert homie you want to see what we got cooking in manzi's kitchen these enchiladas are about to go in the oven this is another thick one two c's All right, enchiladas are ready. Let's pop these in the oven 20 minutes. We all, we do need to do one quick thing, though. You're on vacation. Where you at? Where are you, bro? And also, why didn't you let me uh go in your your travel bag, bro? I want to go on vacation.
Mexico. Nice, dude. Dude, we're we have a problem here, everybody. We do not have enough sauce. Uh oh. I shorted on the sauce. Not like this. Please have an extra line around. Not like this, boys. Not like this. It's okay. They'll still be good. They'll still be good. We'll make it work. I know. I deserve that. I deserve that. You're right. Speech for my failures. This should be fine. It should be okay. So we're going to layer it with some Cheddar Jack, or Mexican Jack, excuse me. You having fun in Mexico so far, Rich? You get some good Mexican food there, bro? What's the highlight of your trip so far? I haven't been there myself. Hello, Bozo. Hello, OG. Hello. How are you, brother? You are very late. Cheers, Bozo. Is that a cheers? Cheers. Mandy Mouse. You like it? You like it, OG? All right. So let me show you. This is going in, everybody. This is our eight enchiladas. It's going to be about 20 minutes. So we'll let that start. A lot of liquor everywhere and I love it. Hell yeah, dude. You've been to any fun uh, bars or clubs there? What have you been up to there? What's the vacation uh, spiel? You know, you feel me? All right, let's see how the filling is. I didn't even taste that. Not, it's a little spicy. It's good. Mm-hmm. Straight fire, bro. Mm-mm-mm. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, shit, we're saved. I found a little bit. We do have a little bit more. Thank the Lord. I think we're okay now. <laughs> they call it Revenge of the Montezuma. Did I put dino nuggets inside? Of course. Definitely. Why would I ever lie to you, OG? Dude, I love Megadeth. What's your favorite Megadeth song? Everybody in the chat, if you like Megadeth, tell me right now, what is your favorite Megadeth song? I want to hear it. Tell me or write me out. I'll kick it with you, Zach, for sure. Three. Bozo is not an answer this time. You mean sweating bullets, not setting bullets, you bozo? Sweating bullets. But 
And a little more, a little more. Don't you mock Taylor Swifty. Don't you do it. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that, bro. Okay, three minutes. Oh, it's already looking good in here. You don't like Taylor Swift, Lazy Gage? What's wrong with T-Swifty, bro? Alright, remind me, everybody. The, the enchiladas on the right side are three minutes behind. Don't let me forget that, okay? It's your responsibility, not mine. Ride the light. Ride the lightning is not Megadeth, bro. That would be a Metallica. Hey, I'm not saying T Swift is better. I'm just saying she can kick it. You're working out. You're doing some. You know, you're on that treadmill. You know what hits? Taylor Swift. See, Mamos gets it. He gets it. She hits. She slaps. Is it really? I didn't know that. That's a good fun fact. Very good. T Swift and Katy Perry too. I get that too. I feel that. Alright, so we're gonna chop up a little cilantro. Sorry, Tiffs. I know it tastes like soap to you, but it doesn't taste like soap to me. We're gonna get a little bit of this chopped up for a nice garnish on top of our enchiladas. Lazy, I'm gonna have to show you the way, bro. I'm gonna have to show you the way. All right, OG, you want to see something fire, though? I know you've got a picky palate at times, but I know you're not going to refuse this. I know you're not going to say no to this. We got a pretzel, pretzel M&M bark, bro. Tell me that doesn't look good. Tell me. Tell me right now. Yeah, I know. Dude, I tried it. It's fire. So, wedding bullets. Yes, I made Badoof shaped pretzels. True. So, a weird take five. What do you mean, take five? Bro, there's nothing like a take five. Yeah, they're Badoofs. Also, don't be mad, OG. Look at the emotes. Your chicken nuggets is gone for the time being. It will be back. But I had to make room for the Manzy Mouse, okay? Don't be disappointed in me. I promise I wasn't trying to hurt you. It'll be back. It'll be back. Don't riot. Don't riot. Okay, we got enough cilantro here. I implore you to reconsider. My brothers, I see in your <laughs> eyes the same fear that would take the heart of me. A day may come Dude, Cap, you did it wrong. Fails, it's supposed to be Badoof, not wolves. We went over this. 
but it is not this You're messing up, bro. An hour of wolves and shattered shields when the age of men comes crashing down. You took but your dab too hot. Day. Yikes. This day we fight. Boy, I need a cutting board. Dear on this good earth. I bid you stand, men of the West. Man, oh man, this will not do. Aha, here we go, here we go. One day, long, long, long time ago, there was <laughs> this mouse. He wasn't. Yeah, that's just the new copy mouse. pasta. He was a special mouse, <laughs> one that lived at a circus. His favorite thing to do was watch the clowns. True. The mouse thought to himself, I True. want to be a clown to dot the quest to become a bozo. True. The mouse trained for years to be the best clown there ever was. He put on a show That's in front me, of smiley everyone. Face. They all laughed at the mouse. But why? He was just a bozo mouse. Who knows, but the legend of Manzi Mouse will continue. <laughs> <laughs> that's the new one. You weren't here for that, Caps. But that's the new copy pasta. Is that on Discord, by the way? That's a that's a relic. My brothers, I see in your <laughs> eyes the same fear that would take the heart of me. A day may come <laughs> when the courage of men fails, when we <laughs> forsake our friends and break all bonds of fellowship. But it is not this day. An hour of bidoofs <laughs> and shattered shields when the age of men comes crashing down. But it is not this day. Thank this you, day Mamos. Thank you. The Copy Pasarina channel. Dear on this good earth, I bid you stand, <laughs> men of the West. Alright, we got a nice cilantro dice for our garnish on our enchiladas. We're missing one thing though, everybody. My I know brothers, I see in your eyes the same I know you guys are gonna have an opinion of this, of but we're gonna garnish it with an avocado. When the courage of men and I understand when not everybody likes avocado. <laughs> That's okay, but, but it is not I do day. and it makes it look pretty, so mouse and shattered shields when the age of men comes crashing down. But it is not this day. This day we fight. By all that you hold dear on this good earth, I bid you stand, men of the West. You're missing the dino nugget. Dude, they're in the enchiladas. By the way, don't do what I'm doing right now unless you know what you're doing. If you use a sharp knife, it'll cut through the skin of the avocado and you'll get a trip, nice trip to the hospital. So don't do what I'm doing right now, okay? Please, for the love of God. A lot of the jobs that I worked, people had to go to the hospital because they were doing what I did. So please, 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 please don't do that. And I know you could say, oh, 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 I've never done it before. I've never cut myself, but please be careful, okay? Please. I shouldn't even have done it because now people get the idea that you can do it like that. Oh, they can't use that one. You like the hospital? No, you don't. You're bluffing. You are bluffing, sir. Alright, and then to get the core out, you pop it and twist, okay? Pop and twist, and it'll come right out. It is my fault. I agree. I agree. Got to be very gentle with this. It's actually quite dangerous. Then you just grab a <laughs> you grab a spoon and you rotate like a circle, okay? And then there you go. You got yourself some avocado. Already sliced and everything ready to go. And that's going to make this look amazing. You'll see. You'll see. Corn all day, every day, baby. 
No, stop it. He's playing me again. Stop it. I'm not a fool. One in the chat if I should give Casey a tree. I'm gonna use the bathroom real quick, everybody. I'll be right back. Make sure you wash your hands. One, 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 one. Nice. Dude, I'll tell you what though. There's a bop it. This was like when I was 17, everybody. And it was, uh, it was in the middle of the night. True story, by the way. Middle of the night. Approximately three in the morning, okay? I was trying to sleep and I heard, I heard bop it. And it was, you know, like twist it, pull it. Yow! Anyways, I, I kept hearing that throughout the night, okay? And I was like, what incarnation is that? I got up, I went, I, you know, located where the sound was coming from. You know what I found? I found a bop it inside a wardrobe and I'm, I'm not even capping it was going off on its own so you know what I did I banished it to the shadow room everybody I took it out of the wardrobe I brought it into the garage and put it in there forever for all eternity because that shit was haunted and I was not going to deal with that shit. I conquered my demons that day. Once upon a time, in a <laughs> far away swamp, there lived an ogre named Shrek, Manzi, whose precious solitude is suddenly a shattered by the annoying fairy Whoa. tale characters. What they a bozo take. They were all banished from their what kingdom by the evil take. Lord Farquaad. Whitehall, determined to save their home, not to mention his, Shrek cuts a deal with Farquaad and sets out to rescue Princess Fiona, ligaments to be Farquaad's bride. Rescuing the princess may be small compared to her deep, dark secret. Right, the classic Manzi tale. Zeus, cut it out. Come on now. Knock it off. Uh, we got we got three minutes guys three extra minutes so you know what we're gonna do in this time we're gonna try this dessert again okay we are gonna try this all right here look at this guys guys and gals look at that cheese Pretzel in the middle, chocolate on the bottom and top, and M&M's on top. What a fucking go. Jeez. God, it's so good, everybody. It is so fire. I wish I could, like, tell you, but it is so good. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm.
Yeah, I hold them captive. Don't tell anyone, though. They're tied. Tied to the wall. Tape, in, tape over their mouths. Pizza, dude! What's up, bro? We got some enchiladas coming out in two minutes, pizza, dude. If you're down, you don't want to miss that. Everything's coming to a closure. It's nice to see you, pizza dude. He puts him in cages and pokes him with cattle fry. <laughs> no, dude, no. The Badoo Shrine Room. Don't tell my secrets, Fligma. Don't you tell them. Don't you tell them my secrets. I thought that was between us. The mouse pondered why they laughed <laughs> at him. He felt such shame, shame. Then some more shame. The mouse ran up to the clown and went right in his face. He squeaked as the clown looked in confusion. Dot, what do you want, you bozo mouse? Said the clown. Suddenly there was a connection. Two bozos staring at each other. He knew from then on he needed to show this mouse the way. What should I name you? Asked the clown. Dude, that's a lit. <laughs> The mouse squeaked in disgust. I shall call you. Yeah, if they don't say my food is good, they get punished. That's true. True and real. Death sentence if they say otherwise. Dare I say. Alright, let's see how it... Ooh, wee! Ooh, wee! Pay 5.99 right. for DLC. Broil time, everybody. Who's down for broil time? Get some crispy, crispy, crispy cheese. Pay $6 for DLC. I'm not drinking any more JMO, but cheers, bro. I got some wine. Cheers, everybody. Or toke up. Whatever floats your boat. I know, Caps. I know. I know, bro. I'm drinking red. It's nice to see you, pizza dude. I know you haven't been around here too long, but let me uh, let me tell you a little bit about what we do here, okay? We do cooking streams every Sunday, wine and dines. We drink, we have fun, we toke up, whatever floats your boat. We do Pokemon streams on Wednesdays if you like Pokemon. We open packs. We play Pokemon games. Whatever, you know. And then besides that, we play story-based games. We're going to be playing the new Final Fantasy in a couple weeks. Um, but yeah, we uh, that's pretty much it. That's what we do here. And we have a blast while doing so. I'm so proud of you. I love you, son. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Thank you. Thank you. That's the only heart you'll ever get If you don't know caps and I know each other IRL Burp <laughs> Troll Dude, weird ads with those copy pauses though, on point. Can we get that one linked to Discord as well? That one's amazing. I bet you he's been working on those behind the scenes too. The Knights of the Bozos are the legendary knights of the Fellowship of King Manzi that first appeared in the Grand Circus. Thanks Mamos, thank you bro. Uh, you guys want a sneak peek? One in the chat if you want to see these uh, these spicy nudes, these enchiladas. Two for Bozo, and three for I don't even like enchiladas.
Ah, you guys want to see it, huh? You want to see Three. it? You want to see what we've got cooking, huh? Alright. I'll tell you right now, these bad boys are done. They're looking at great. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Check this out. This is over 9,000. Look at that. Sheesh. It does need about a minute. So we're going to pop it right back in. But good uh, lord. I cannot wait to eat that. I cannot wait. But yeah, we also, um, Pizza Dude, we open Pokemon packs on stream. We have actually a Channel Point Redemption, 7,500 points, and I, I actually have the box with me. I will, I'll show you. For 7,500 points, just by watching, you can literally make me open this nice mystery box of packs. We got a ton of packs in there, and I'll rip one on stream. And all you got to do is watch. It's that easy. Smile. What's up, bro? Yeah, somebody redeemed it. Somebody did a redemption for it. So I had to bring it down. Now we got another one, Caperoni. All right, here we go. Enchilada's done. Ooh wee! Oh shit. These are just, these are literally like almost burnt. I think they're great though. Honestly, t maybe 10 seconds too long, but they'll play, they'll play. <laughs> now they're not burnt. They are definitely not burnt. That's exactly why you put them on broil, because the cheese. They're not burnt. I'll show you. Emotional damage. Gotta put the wifey to bed. Sounds good. They are slightly overdone, but they're not burnt. I was looking for this. Come on in. You, you. He's playing me like a fool. Where did I put the glove? Here comes the fun part, everyone. Here comes the fun part. No, stop it. We gotta garnish it. Make it look nice and pretty. I know cilantro is not everybody's spiel, but... For those that do like it, this is the perfect color for the dish. We actually need a little bit more, so let's get a little bit more. Smile, when do you go on your uh, your Japan trip? It's soon, right? I was thinking about that the other day. You better get me something cool. I will, Caps. This is an important moment. I haven't forgotten about your pack, bro. Trust me. You are good. August. Oh shit, that's pretty long actually. That's what she said. Alright, that should be plenty. It's gonna look even better. Type one in the chat if you like avocados. I'm sure uh, half the chat isn't gonna like them, so. And that is totally okay, but we are gonna garnish it with a nice, delicious slice of avocado I as shall well. Call you Mouse. 
The mouse squeaked in delight <laughs> almost making a weird giggling noise. Almost like Mickey Mouse. Mansy Mouse watched the clown clean he watched him cook he watched him be a bozo at his <laughs> finest. Following him around. He even tried to help him build his computer but he formatted the clown's hard drive. Whoa, whoa, this whoa. Is where the clown you don't need to mouth. tell them that part. Never format a clown's hard drive. The clown kicked <laughs> the mouse to the curb. Never come back again. You're you doxing me, bro. The clown said. The good thing about a garnish for avocado, though, is you don't have to eat it. You can just take it off. That's the good part. Alright, so we'll put a little bit more on there. A little bit more. Perfect. That looked delightful. Okay. And then we'll line it with some avocado. You guys see this? Take note. Look at that nice color. Wow. Wow. These are pretty thick slices, though, huh? It's almost like I did this while drunk. Whose fault is that? Wow. Can somebody make a quick clip for me, please? Of this delightful meal I've got here. Here we go. This is it. This is it. These are the enchiladas, everybody. Look at that. Sheesh. I hope you guys had fun. They need to cool for about five minutes, but before that, we do have a pack to open for Mr. All Caps. Caps, pick a number one through ten, bro. One through ten. I'll pick a number seven. You, bro. Nice try, OG. One through ten, Caps. You could even do 1 through 50 if you really want to. You know what? 1 through 50, bro. I'll even let you pick through the whole box. You still want to stick with 7? Is that still the one? I mean, 7's a good one. Thirty six. You got it. You got it. One. Ten. Fifteen. Twenty. Twenty five. Thirty. 35 36 your pack today is a lost origin pack will we get the guarantee garatina the $300 card we'll see can we get some uh, blue balls in chat please some blue balls for caps redemption I'm not opening it until I see some blue balls guys Do you want to see some fire or what? All right, all right. Let's see what we got in here, shall we? Got a darkness, a bronze on. A box of disaster, you know, a 
Let's get some more light. I think it's a little bit better right here. Box of Disaster. The Galarian Stun Fist. A right on these nuts. An A palm. A Rosalia. A Gumi. A Meditite. Oh, yo! A gold Pikachu! Let's fucking go, dude! Look how dope that is! Sheesh! All for you, Caps. This was you, bro. Wow. That card is sick. Victory Screech. Damn. I I'm going to have to check the price of that in a second here. All right. And we got to mix our rice here, everybody. We got a nice Spanish rice to go with this. All right, check this out. Look at that. Look at this Spanish rice, everybody. Sheesh. All right, let's make a plate, shall we? Let's make a plate. You want the Pikachu? I don't know, bro. Oh, we got Rickroll, the first Rickroll on the stream. Who did it? It was OG. What a bozo. You got me. We also got these nuts on there. Classic, right? For the request of Mama Ozop. Honestly, I think this cheese is perfect. I know it kind of looks like it's burnt, but I think it's perfect. I implore I really you did. to reconsider. Let's go. Let's go with this slice right here. This looks perfect. Wow. Wow. Come on. Wow. Your birthday is soon. You really want one? I have an extra. If that's what you want, bro, I can send you that. For sure. I'm not even capping right now. I can ship it to you. I don't remember how much it is. I wasn't doing that as a pun, by the way, because of your name. But I think it's like $7 or so. If I remember correctly. Yeah, you can have this one, bro. I have a spare. I can send you one. Let's get some nice Spanish rice on this plate. Like that. When is your birthday, Caps? Should. I'm getting sloppy, boys. When is your birthday, Caps? August 12th. That's not that soon. That's quite a bit of ways, bro. That is quite a bit of ways. Okay, 
we got some nice sour cream on the side here y'all ready to see this who's down to see a taste test check this out everybody that concludes the cooking stream this evening let me show you what we got here we've got a uh, Dude, I don't know anybody's birthday. It's not even like an offense at this point. I can barely remember my own birthday. All right. We got a nice chicken enchilada with some Spanish rice. Look at that, bro. Some sour cream on the side. I know the plating isn't wonderful, but I've been drinking, so. But look at that, guys. Look at that, boys and girls. Who would eat the shit out of that? Sheesh. All right, let's see how it tastes. Oh my lord, look at that. All right, let's show you guys what it looks like on the interior. Look at that, bro. Look at that. Mm hmm bro bro whole oh. dude that's actually perfect the the crispiness on top of the enchilada is so good man i actually you know what i said i would cook it for 20 seconds longer well i lied because i actually think this is perfect it gives you such a nice texture it's still cheesy it's delicious spicy scale four i actually think it's not that spicy I, it's amazing bro wow holy crap that's so good wow okay maybe a five or a six on the spicy wow it's truly spectacular this time One more time. One more time, everybody. Yeah, it's a creeper spice. Look how beautiful that looks, man. With the garnish on there, the cilantro, the avocado. One more time. Let me get a bite with the avocado on there. Look at that, boys and girls. Look at that. Wow. This is really good, guys. All right, well, as you guys know, unfortunately, good times must come to an end. And that concludes everything that we've done here. The cooking stream is officially over. Wine and Dine Episode 5 super successful super tasty super delicious very happy with how this turned out very happy and thank you so much for the one follow from pride pride door and the mama bozo gifted for lick ligmanus himself i appreciate every one of you guys i love you all I already asked my father. He doesn't want to be on stream caps. I can ask Vespin though. You guys want me to ask Vespin? Let me see if he wants to. Okay. Before I end, I'll see if he wants to give you guys an opinion. Tips, are you streaming, girl? Okay, then can we have 
Can we have somebody pick a streamer to raid, please, for me? It's kind of hard to look for me right now. You want to come try this on stream and tell them how you think? Alright, Vespin's on his way. Can we get some pogs for Vespin? He's going to do a taste test for all of y'all. But yeah, is there anybody that's got a buddy that's streaming, you know, any friends? Gotta send this ship somewhere. Please let me know. Dude, this is so good, guys. I wish you could, I could, like, share this with all of y'all. Huh? You gonna be on camera or no? Okay. It's Manzy guy's good, let's raid him. I wish, bro. I wish. But yeah, I appreciate every single one of you guys. I know I've said that before, but thank you. Thank you for being part of this community, guys. Thank you for hanging out, watching me cook. You now do my thing. Yeah, there's black beans in it. Hold on, don't fight it yet. You want to tell them how you feel? God, your head is so small. a lot of people that agree with me. Yeah, I'm making it hotter. I know. I can tell. That's why I said there might not be people that agree. Yeah, the sauce is getting better every time you make it. Probably like a nine. Only because it's so mild. But there you had it. Your boy can cook. If you ha were ever doubting me. Alright, well, thank you so much, guys. Um, Let me see if I have anybody streaming as well. Granny No Scope. Let's check that out. You think so? The cheat? Dude, it's not burnt, right? See, my brother just said it's not burnt, the cheese is better. And y'all were like, damn, that shit looks burnt. Fuck no, that is not burnt, my guys. No, it's a HyperX cloud. Yeah. Is Granny No Scope on right now? Yeah, that was, you got the Bertha one, I think. All right, Granny No Scope, that's the one. All right. So you guys know the drill, okay? We are about to end, Mamos. I will sh show you though. The plate is clean. It was amazing. A, a solid nine for the enchilada, for sure. It was delicious, bro.
Brother, how old is Manti? I'm 29, bro. Alright, let's raid Granny No Scope. Show some love, please. Spam the heart emote. I better see some heart emotes. I better see some emotes in her channel. Show the love. You guys know the drill. <laughs> you old fuck. You're an old fuck, bro. Oh, did I spell it wrong? No. Why is it not working? Hold on. We gotta do an audible, everybody. I know. What a bozo. What a bozo. Let me pull up the dashboard. Alright, here it goes, everybody. Show that fucking love, okay? Be nice, show the love, spam the emotes, make me proud, okay? And thank you again for supporting and tuning in. Alright, have a great rest of your night, guys. Peace, much love, and I am out of here.